Hello people and welcome back! Yes, we're back finally after so, so, so long. We're back. We're back, we're back, we're back, we're back, and we're back with Zoo Tycoon 2. Because apparently this is really popular and I don't know why. So, let us fire up game. And yeah! Let's play Zoo 2. Zoo blah, 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 I can't talk. We're gonna do this. And there's a helicopter flying overhead. But I don't know if you can hear it. Let's go! Alright, so we are back. And if you remember correctly, before I had said something about um, building up my zoo. I forgot how to. That's. I had said something about building up my zoo a little bit. And. Yeah, no. That didn't happen. <laughs> In fact, it's been a while since I made a video. I apologize for that. Um, but we are back. We're kicking ass. There's been a lot of good stuff that has been happening. So, as you can see, um, I'm going to pause the game for a moment so I can ramble. As you can see, nothing's really been going on here, and I cannot figure out how to... Uh, eh. I've, like, completely forgotten the controls for a game because it's been that long since I have played. Oh, well. Shift, control, alt, no, space, no. Anyway, let's take a look at our objective is because I've forgotten them. Okay, so providing a startup zoo. So it's a new startup zoo and we want to obtain $5,000 in guest donations. Now then, pause. In order to do that, we obviously need to set up some habitats for some animals and adopt some animals and then the people, they come, they see the animals, and they eat foods, and they donate monies, and the animals get all happy, and blah blah blah. So, we were going to see what can we have. Okay, so we can have male and female animals, a bongo, an American bison, a beluga, and then these ones have not been unlocked yet because we need fame stars, which are up here. So, uh, that's animal food, enrichment, shelters, right. So I think to start, what we will probably do is we will get a moose and probably an American bison. And maybe a peafowl, because yeah, peafowls are cool. So, let us start off with the bison. It likes the green grassy bottoms. So, what we're going to do? It's an electric fence. No, that's bad. <laughs> we don't want that to happen. Dinosaur fence. Low tundra fence. We don't live in the tundra. Staff gate. Tundra. Uh, I'm confused. A weak fence. <laughs> a weak fence with a small electric charge to keep to discourage animals from escaping. Ha ha ha. No no no, you will not escape. This does not help me. It's not like I remember how to do this stuff. This is a gate. Which I guess are cool. Okay, I'm gonna put the gate here because this entire section this triangle section is going to be for Z bison. Z bison. So if I can get this gate right. <laughs> Come on! What? Oh, it was working. It was working. <laughs> I'm failing at this. There we go. We have a gate. That's the wrong direction, isn't it? How do we rotate? Oh. No, it's it's all. <sighs> we already lost money. <laughs> Just from that little scope. Okay. Uh, get to, um, no. 
We will do things correctly. Correctly. Animal shelters. Straight shade structure, a small wooden structure, and a small stable. Why they like stables, I'm not entirely sure. But they do. Construction. There we go. Now then, I think we want a wooden fence because wooden fences are good. They're better than chain link fences, obviously. Rawr. So, what we are going to do is we're going to set up. Nope. Straight. There we go. I'm going to set it up down the length of this. Uh oh. Yeah, that's good. And we are going to bring it up to about here. And maybe a little more. A little more. There we go. And oh, we're going to do the same thing over here. Just go this way. Oops. I think this is good. This is probably good. And then straight over to here. Uh oh. I need it to go up here one more. There we go. And then over to here. I think this is a pretty good fence. I know I'm rambling, and I know this part is probably pretty boring. But then you get to watch me fail so hard and be like, you idiot, that's not how you make a bio-enclosed shelter. And then I'm going to be like, ha ha ha, I don't really care. I wouldn't actually say that. I, well, yeah, I would. Um, so, these guys kind of like it grassy, apparently. Who knew? And we will include plants and a couple of rocks. Do -do -do. I don't know. I think we need more plants. Now it says it likes these trees, so which is good because we're gonna have some trees. And it will kind of be a little bit like my other shelter, if you remember, my other enclosure, if you remember, for the zebras. And that, this way. It'll be right there. And all of mine will kind of have the same basic theme, I suppose. What do they like for food? They like hay. We'll make some hays. And berries. Hay, berries, and grass. So do that and probably some of this and then wata food dish can accommodate one large or four smaller animals at a time now that I know that I'm gonna put you like right here probably move you See, I do remember how to play. <laughs> Just barely. I know enough not to screw up my animals' lives. Oh, uh, you wouldn't screw up your animals' lives. Yeah, I would. Okay, that is the staff gate. And... Yeah. This looks pretty nice. I'm gonna do a couple of divots in the land here. I can find the button, Habitat Editor. This is going to make a gentle hill, not a cliff. I like just, just a little something here. Like, whoops, no, no, no. But, dang it. What have I done? Okay, damn. There we go. A few divots here and there. Yes, yes, yes. Divots. 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 You can be like, oh, hills, it's variety. Yes, it is variety. 
Now, if I can find the path, there we go. Um, is this the same? Is this the same? I hope so. No, it isn't. Oh no! I don't know what this is. Where's the eyedropper tool when I need it? Uh, no, no. Actually, that would be pretty cool, which I might do later. I don't know what I'm going to do for that pool. Um, I don't want a tank. I really don't want a tank. I don't want to mess with that yet. Tundra path, sand path. Uh, yeah, whatever. We'll just, we'll go with asphalt for now. And, oops. <laughs> Uh, you can tell where my head is. My my head's just not in it. I mean, it is in it. It's just like derp, derp, derp. There, stretch it, stretch it out. Yeah. And then yeah, kind of like that. Just kind of. It'll just be half center and everything. And it'll be like, oh, what have you done? And I'll be like, eh. I thought it was a good idea at the time. <laughs> really, I did think it was a good idea at the time. Really. Really. Oh, there was something I also wanted to do. Mm, shallow water? Maybe shallow water over here? I'm not sure how they're used to like shallow water, so I don't know if they would like it or not, but eh. <laughs> they have some shallow water now. You will have shallow water and you will like it. And what other stuff do we want? Let's have a bench. Two benches, like right here. They're like, oh, it's a bench, yay! Kind of like, Oh, yay, bison, yay! <laughs> and trash cans are generally good. What else do we want? A donation box. Which I guess can be like right here. Donate here! Give me money! Yeah. Yes, I understand guests enjoy loving that one. I'm in my zoo. I don't know how long I've been recording. I've been recording for like 10 minutes or something. Oh yes, and the Edumicator platform. Because we need to teach them about the American bison and how everyone wants to kill them and that's not cool and stuff like that. Stuff like that. Which means we need staff, we need an Edumicator. Hello, Edumicator. You're gonna stand there. We're going to need, probably need a maintenance worker. And we actually still have a lot of money. Blah, 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 blah. Zookeeper. Zookeeper's gonna go in here. Now then, now that that's done, that's such a long walk over there. What will they do while they walk well i have an idea i has ideas yes 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 what we're going to do is we're going to make foods for them hot dog food stand what's the difference between this one and the other one i guess one looks different meh 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 pretzels may make guests thirsty and then you have a soda drink stand right next to it. Uh, I'm smart. So, we'll have a hot dog stand here. On the other side, we can have a pretzel stand. And then as they walk down the road... Actually, wait, they need probably need ATMs in order to even like get in. Because, yeah... ATMs are good. There, have an ATM. Like, oh yay, ATMs! Let's get more money to spend here! <laughs> yeah. 
I am a little cynical. <laughs> and a little bit of other things. Yes, you will sit next to the ATM machine. You will feel the presence of money. Give me money. Expense report. I've been buying a crap load of stuff. That's my expense report. Yay, soda! Because you need to drink and stuffs. Um... I remember I also wanted something else. Did I want this? Yeah, a small bathroom. Yeah. Small restroom. Why can these only accommodate one at a time? That's actually pretty terrible. I want it away from the food, but like still accessible. So I think what I'll do, clear this out. Yeah, loudness. There. Clear this out, and then we will extend this path to the restroom. Which will look weird. Because, yeah. I'm just gonna make it look like this. So, yeah, guys. As you can see, I'm back, sort of, in all of my derpy awesomeness form and yeah we're just going to be doing this for a while so I guess I could cut it off here I don't <laughs> keep messing up why why do you why do you fail so hard possum guy because son that's how you learn in life you gotta learn how to Take the knots and the punches and learn how to fail just a little bit. But I thought failing was bad. Failing is bad, son. Only if you don't learn from it. So, yeah. My brain's gone derp. And we're actually down to 19,000, but that's okay, because we started with 30, so I can probably make another habitat. Probably a little closer. Maybe around here? Kind of like flamingos, it can be like, ooh, flamingos, ooh. We like the flamingos. I want a misty spring. We're going to research that. For the meantime, carrots! Eat the carrots! That's all they like for enrichment? It's pretty sad. Oh well. I don't know what to do with this. If someone has an idea what to do with this, that would be awesome. If someone has an idea of what to name my creatures, that would be even more awesome. However, now the recording has gone on for about almost 20 minutes and I am talking in a very strange voice. That being said, if you would like to help me name these animals that I will be putting into my zoo, feel free to leave a comment. I have a lot of comments as it is. And, as always, have a nice day and stay crazy! Laters!